The Africa Forum at the International Water Association Development Congress is important because it's an opportunity for African water leaders to meet and to discuss and exchange experience about issue. We went through droughts and water scarcity in Africa, how to deal with it, what were the experiences in the various countries. We had a nice opportunity to have a consultant who talked technicity about uh, uh, drought and, uh, and, and, and water scarcity. And it was quite interesting to see how uh, institution, uh, let's say institution-wise, policies should be uh, driven around these activities on drought, bringing drought as uh, risk management more than a crisis management. And I think that it gave uh, quite many ideas to uh, the African leaders in the room to uh, deal with this issue. The second part of the session was on non-revenue water and this was quite interesting because we had experiences from water utilities uh, from Swaziland, from National Water and also uh, the African Water Association was explaining its program on non-revenue water reduction in sub-Saharan Africa and we had very interesting uh, exchange of information on what the utilities are doing to improve the non-revenue water. For the regulatory aspect of the water sector, I think each country has their own rules. I know that we should have, we couldn't have a common rule to, to, to run the water sector, um, but the regulatory aspect is, is quite different in various countries. But it's good to exchange experience and see what the others are doing and try to use some of the best aspect of what the others are doing to uh, put regulation on your side. The main big thing that has been done is to raise awareness on the need for water utilities to look at the non-revenue water issues. Because when you have non-revenue water uh, around 40% to 50%, it's a very big problem. So first of all, you have to raise awareness on the issue. Then you have to find ways to reduce non-revenue water. And this is uh, through uh, capacity building, but not capacity building coming from outside, capacity building among water utilities, because they are the one who work on daily operation of water utilities, and they are the one who knows that there is a problem. And if you capacity build a water utility good enough to uh, uh, capacity build other utilities in collaboration, I think that you have a sustainable way to reduce non-revenue water. So this is what AFWA is doing, putting up some capacity building programs on non-revenue water reduction to improve this really big issue of African water utilities.